Welcome, today we will create a game that runs in the browser using Swift. For this we will use Tokamak, which is a framework that is compatible with Swift UI that renders elements to the HTML DOM using WebAssembly and JavaScript. It's still pretty early on in development, but the canvas element is already implemented, which translates to the HTML canvas. If you're familiar with Swift UI, then a lot of what you see on screen right now uh, will be familiar to you too as well. We can also insert arbitrary HTML elements. So if something is not yet implemented, we can just implement it ourselves. Another package that we will use is JavaScript Kit, which allows us to execute JavaScript from Swift without actually writing JavaScript, which I like very much. I also installed Carton to test and build our project. It's really easy to set up and use. So the first thing I did was test out the HTML canvas, just filling the whole canvas with a specific color. I had some trouble in the beginning, but once I actually got the documentation to build, I was off to a good start. Here I'm trying to debug a problem, only to find out that it just wasn't implemented yet, so I had to slightly alter my code. Eventually I got it working though. Unfortunately, there is currently a bug in Carton, which means that I don't have hot reloading, which kind of sucks, but it's okay. I tried resizing the canvas but had no luck. So then I tried you doing it with CSS and JavaScript, but it also didn't work. But you'll see more of this later, because for now I'm dropping this.
So at this point I have a working game. The snake gets bigger and faster every time he eats. When food is eaten, new food appears and I keep a score. Not bad for my first game. I then improved my game with a high score that is kept in the browser using local storage, which Tokamak also provides a very easy API for. I then also implemented all the features that were still missing, like when a snake bites itself or when a snake goes out of the screen. I ran into a problem where the canvas just kept resizing and getting bigger and bigger. I decided to fork Tokamak and create a canvas with a fixed size. This would solve my problem and I could set the size myself. Sadly I do not have any footage of this. Because apparently I ran out of disk space and I only had like 500 megabytes left. So I decided to take the 7 gigabytes of footage I had accumulated and move it to another drive. So at this point we have a working game. Now let's make it look a little bit prettier by giving the canvas some padding. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to take a closer look at the code, everything is available on GitHub, link in the description. And if you want to play the game yourself, you can do that on my website, I'll also link that in the description.